So, what do In Excess, Silverchair, and Birds of Tokyo all have in common? Well, they're just some of the prestigious Australian acts associated with the Grove Studios. And it ain't just for the highly established. A lot of young, exciting up-and-comers like Vera Blue, Alice in Wonderland, and Ocean Alley have all been involved with the iconic Grove and its crew. I think the most important thing when making a record is preparation and not rushing. I think you know, having a solid vision on what you want to make. The biggest tips of having a great sounding record, funnily enough, isn't technical. It's very much the creative side of it. To get it right at the source is always really important. If the artist feels comfortable, it usually reflects through the sound really well. So creating a vibe and energy is incredibly important to making a great sounding record. Again, preparation is key to getting the most out of you know a session. You could have the best microphones and the best equipment in the world, and it's not going to make a lick of difference. By allowing yourself to then be as open to the creative process as possible and sort of facilitate that, you are going to make the best record. Nestled in a remote and scenic getaway spot on the New South Wales Central Coast, the facility is truly hidden from the rest of the world, allowing artists, writers and producers to work away from all the noise and be surrounded by absolute peace and serenity. How's the serenity? So much serenity. And in an effort to foster the future of the music industry, the team behind The Grove have created The Grove Studios Academy, training a new generation of producers and engineers who go on to help shape the sound of Australia's music scene. Students can gain a variety of experiences at The Grove Studios Academy. One of our major features is that the Academy is built within The Grove Studios, so it's a functioning active recording studio where lots of artists are there working from at the moment you know Courtney Barnett, Julia Jacqueline, Birds of Tokyo. It's a space that is you know active and living and breathing culture into the Australian music scene. It's not just about pro tools and, and digital interfaces that goes into analog recording and you know it, it allows you to get the skills to build a business in the music industry as well as having you know great musical skills. The school will be opening its doors to a select group of students in its first year, giving them access to a full working recording studio with all of the high-end gear and experienced producers that come with it. And you get a proper qualification at the end, a diploma of music industry. Look, they could totally be you. There are no prerequisites either, just bring your creativity and passion. So hey, if this sounds like your jam, listen up. The Grove Studios Academy will be having an open day on Saturday the 28th of April, so if you want to get your groove on at The Grove, hit up that website for more details.